So I had to move inside because it got really cold and I knew that the paint was never going to dry out there. And in the process of carrying it in, I got paint on my hand from the grip. Wah, wah. But I pulled the mustard off of here just to see what it looked like and it comes out pretty good um you can kind of see the uh the mustard in there like here you can see it just wherever i put the mustard the paint just comes right off. It's a messy job. And again, I don't know why I don't have my glove on. But, yeah, see, there you go. It's a good idea to get the mustard off as soon as you can because it can have an adverse effect on the paint underneath because it's got vinegar in it. But this needs to set up some more before I can finish. So this is the work area for the gun. Um, you can see the magazine clip I'm working on here. Um, yeah, so that's that. So, the gun, I used this black cardstock, and, or, it's foam core, so it's nice and light, but it has good structure, and holds up well. You just have to remember, if you're gonna paint it, you have to cover that foam, or else it's gonna eat it all up. Uh, so, start to finish, I started Friday night, and I am about 90% done, maybe a little more, on the gun. So, I'll really all I have left to do is the, is the rounds and the magazine. So, yeah, there it is. I'll post again when I'm pulling off more of the mustard.